The Mississippi Air National Guard held its change of command ceremony today. WJTV 12 Shay O'Connor was there and joins us here in the studio with more on what this means to the National Guard and the state of Mississippi. Shay. Jade, I visited the change of ceremony at the Mississippi National Guard Headquarters Auditorium. Now, there, General Billy Neighbors assumed command of Mississippi Air National Guard, replacing General William Hill. Now, Hill retired today after 30 years of service with the National Guard. We hate to see him go. He's an outstanding officer uh, that has uh, served with uh, selfless service for many years. Uh, I'm extremely uh, proud to be following him. He has a long legacy in the Air National Guard that I hope to be able to follow through with. General Billy Mike Neighbor says it is a bittersweet moment, replacing General William Hill and becoming the new head of MSANG, or Mississippi Air National Guard. Hill retired today after 30 years of service. In a crowded room, friends, family, and members of the MS National Guard paid tribute with gifts and spoken words for the general, who has served as head of MSANG for the last three years. The men and women of the Mississippi our guard. They are tremendous people. Um, they do a, a great job. And really all the Mississippi National Guard um, uh, do a lot of great work, you know, for this nation and for this state. And it's, uh, it was, you know, uh, an honor to be able to, uh, to represent them. The Mississippi National Guard has three bases within the Magnolia State. Retired General Hill says the men and women of MSANG put their lives on the line to serve the people of Mississippi. Still, he says it is time for him to pass the torch, giving the next person up the opportunity to lead a great unit of people. You know, it's time. Um, Mike Neighbors going to General Mike Neighbors going to do a great job, and I'm excited. Like I said, I'm excited to uh, to see what he does. And the event today also captured a very historic moment, the passing of the colors from the outgoing commander to the incoming one. And you can view this story on WJTV.com. Reporting in studio, Shay O'Connor, WJTV 12.